Okay, good evening everybody. It's the Boreham game tonight, um, FA Cup game. Open for a decent big score by Everton. Um, do you know what? I normally, well, not normally, I watch the, um, always watch the press conferences, uh, Frank Lampard's press conferences before um, each game, get them going to him before the games in general. Couldn't even finish this week's because all he was getting asked was about um, was about USM and all that, and it was it was boring. I think it was even boring for him because obviously he's the manager of the football club. Do you know what I mean? He's not making decisions, and that was a bit annoying because you just want to hear about football. But um, yeah, so I don't I actually don't know who's starting or anything yet tonight because the the squad's not out. So gotta wait and see that. So um, yeah, open for open for a good good few goals by Everton tonight. Um, it should be nice and comfortable, um, whoever plays really, but no disrespect to Bournemouth of course, but should be nice and comfortable, so uh, looking forward to it, uh, get in there, enjoy the game. There you go, half time. Um, shit, really. Sorry, excuse the language, but um, 
not very good at all, in my opinion. Um, Hatsun looked alright, but just nothing. I haven't recorded much of the first half, because there wasn't much to record, I'll be honest. Um, we're attacking this end next half, so hopefully there's more, but honestly, um, atmosphere was a bit flat as well, if I'm honest. Um, <laughs> anyway, let's see if the second half's better, let's hope it is. Fingers crossed, Blues. Okay, people, so there you go. Um, I'm doing this end video in the car because it's raining. It's quite it's quite wet, um, and I'm wet enough as it is. So, yeah, there we go. 2-0 um, against Borenwood. 2-0, um, you know, it was a comfortable game for Everton, really comfortable in the fact that Borenwood didn't, they didn't offer anything. They didn't really they didn't come forward at all. Their, their tactic was was to defend obviously and I don't blame them for that at all and it's it's hard for us you know it's hard for any team to break down a team that's that's just solid defense and they were really disciplined as well to give them their due they were um they were disciplined in their defense they ran out of steam I think so we we got the we got the first goal um and then they were just they it looked like you know they just didn't have anything left in the tank to to come back at us um it opened up for more goals. Rondon played great today. Uh, Rondon, he had a really good game. He got the two goals. Yeah, it wasn't just that, though. He, he'd done a lot more. He'd done a lot of... Um, he was tracking back in and trying to win the ball back in and trying... He was he, he was like the one that was giving us a bit of a bit of boost, a bit of momentum, to be honest. Um, Gordon had a good game, especially second half. When Richardson come on, um, Gordon seemed to offer um, a bit more. 
he, well, what, what do I say? He, he became more direct um, when Richarlison was on. Um, I'll tell you what, Patterson, first time we've been able to have a look at Patterson. Um, he was good. He, he played this kind of right, right midfield, right wing sort of role. And he was good. He looked really good. He had some pace on him. Um, some pace, like, so he looked good. Mikalenko was good until he went off. Um, Mikalenko having a couple of shots. Um, he went off injured, unfortunately. He had been shoved into into the billboards um, so shortly before he went off. So hopefully it's just a little bit of um, like a little bit of bruising and nothing too bad, hopefully. Um, I've got to say, if Borenwood fans um, let themselves down at the end, um, you could, or you could see him fighting at the front, like they were fighting with stewards, throwing punches. So, you know, it's only, it's, it's only going to be a, a small minority of them. But honestly, it, it did let them down, you know. Um, other than that, it was like um, it's kind of good spirits between between the the, the fans really and, and the clubs especially. Um, you know, all the Everton fans were were clapping each of their subs and everything coming off, and then they let themselves down at the end. So um, that was unfortunate. Um, other than that, do you know what we we got through? We did what we had to, didn't we? Um, got the two goals. The first half was flat, as I said at half time. The first half was really quite flat, um, but I do think it was difficult us. Trying to break them down, trying to break down eleven men behind the ball. Um, I think we should have been able to, but anyway, nevertheless, do you know what? We're through. Crystal Palace next round, eh? Crystal Palace away, tough game, but we're through. So, you know, um, fingers crossed for that. I'm actually in London that weekend, so I might see if I can uh, see if I can get to that one as well. Um, but anyway, um, on to the next one. Uh, so, fingers crossed, uh, Blues. On to the next one. Get some get some points on the table. So you can get past, past Palace in the next game. And uh, yeah, keep going. Keep climbing. Uh, cheers, everyone. Hope you like the video. Please like, share, subscribe. Thanks, everyone. Take care.